and welcome to Have Guitar. I hope you're doing great as always. I have gotten quite a few questions about how to set up Ignite Emissary in your door, and this is how. Let's go! First of all, you should download this pack, STL Ignite Emissary Plugin Bundle. You can find it at this address, but you can also find that link in this video's description. Uh, so in this pack that costs zero dollar, you'll get Emissary 2.0 and you will get Nadir Impulse Response Loader and a few uh, impulse responses as well. I'm not going to go into very deep what an IR is, but you can imagine it like a virtual uh, capture of a guitar cabinet, really. So you need that one. Uh, so now you got all you need to run Emissary, right? No, wait a minute. Okay, so if you don't have a door, which is a digital audio workstation, you can download Reaper, which we, you can try out for eternity if you want to, but it's not expensive to buy. Uh, so you need a door, and then we're ready to go, right? Now, wait a second. Let's follow that cable. Ah, you need a, a sound interface as well. Otherwise, I'm not sure how we're going to get the guitar into your computer, so to speak. I have mine set up, as you can see, uh, in the front of the sound card, which is a Focusrite Sapphire 6i6 second generation. So, now we have everything we need to run... What? Ignite Emissary. So, I've already prepared a little uh, guitar track here, uh, and you can see what I've done here. If I can get that up on screen, it would be great. I have Ignite Emissary in the first spot. I've done very little tweaking to the sound actually, so excuse me if it sounds bad. Uh, then you need the Nadir, which comes in the pack with uh, Emissary. This is the cab loader. Uh, these files are IR files, already mentioned. Uh, capture of guitar cabinet. Uh, and you can run two of them in parallel uh, within um, uh, Nadir. Uh, because without them, it will sound like crap. Let's de-engage that one and that one. Uh, uh, and let's see how this sounds. This is without any cab attached. <laughs> well, we don't need to listen more to that, right? So, let's activate the Nadir. Now it sounds like this. Let's activate the TSB, which is a free VST plugin emulating a guitar drive pedal. Um, I've done some uh, settings here, but never mind about that. Then it sounds like this. But of course, uh, once you have recorded, you can also uh, change the cabs. Let's do that. So. There are a few cabs uh, that you can get online, uh, like this one, ML Sound Labs best IR in the world. I'm not sure if that's true, but let's try adding that here. This will still be active though, and let's see how that sounds. As you can hear, the cab will do quite a big difference on the sound that you'll get. Let's just try another one for the sake of it. Let's take the 41.1 uh, and try it again. And that's it really. If you can't hear anything while you're playing, you might need to activate the record monitoring on, on your door, which is here in Reaper. If you get too much latency, you should go to Options, Preferences, uh, device. Now I have voice meter here. This is just for recording my screen and the sound from it. So I need to change to my Focusrite USB ACO. Press ACO configur configuration and then you'll have to change the buffer size. Uh, if you get latency, you probably have a higher value here. 64 is more than enough for me. But you can experiment whatever you need. If you take too low and your computer can't handle it, you will get uh, crackle, snap and pop and stuff like that, you'll notice. Uh, so in worst case, you might need a new computer. Uh, hopefully not. 
but that's why I changed the latency. It's on the actually the the software for your sound card or sound interface. And that, my friends, is how you do it. Uh, easy as pie. I hope this video gave you some help. If it did, feel free to su support me by a subscription to have guitar. Uh, that'll be more than welcome. To all of you who already do subscribe, thanks a lot. Thumbs up. You're the best. Uh, and with that said, there is a new video out every Thursday. Never forget about that. Alright, so uh, stay clean and play really hard. Until I see you next time, goodbye.